one owner car guy, and we are almost up to the Los Angeles Convention Center here. And just chugging on down the road. Just want to show you the traffic. But I left at 4 o'clock today and I missed all that. So, we're going up the Interstate 5 and going to take off to Disneyland here basically to get to the convention center. And I was gonna make a couple videos while I'm up here. Of the big Disneyland lane and all that. It's a Discovery Science Center there. I've been there for years. All the kids wanna go there. Oh, and that little rocket thing. It's been there forever too. And the Angel Stadium is also up here on the right. Bye bye I-5 and get off and fight the city traffic now. Shouldn't be too bad by the Disneyland this early. Well rats don't get up this time. What is it? 615. Geez, that didn't take long at all. I'm in Lakeside. And by the time I got fueled up and got out of there was close to 5 till 5 is exactly what it was. It was 5 till 5. 6.20. Hour and 25 minutes. They said an hour 49 or an hour 59 on that quest. I've been up here so many times I could drive here with my eyes closed. Okay. Well, not here with my eyes closed, but... Well, there's the Paradise Pier. I couldn't get my camera on soon enough. But your Disney Hotel and such is right down here. We're on Disneyland Drive. I wonder how many people have got the idea to steal that sign. Sorry if it was blurry. It is a really cool place out on Catella there. Real pretty, and real pretty coming down Disney Drive. But I was just gonna shoot down around here and take a little video while I was in the area. The free outside the park Disneyland tour, yes sir. -y. There you go, where's one of the trams? And this has turned into three or four parks now. And downtown Disney and all this stuff. And you gotta buy like six freaking tickets to get into all this stuff. My sister brought her kids and everybody up there, up here, and yeah. Well, let's just say they ain't getting the close to 100 bucks out of me. That's just not happening. You can downtown Disney all you want. I'm not going to downtown Disney. But I will take a video over here. OneOwnerCarGuy.com gonna be a, look at that. This is gonna be harder to get out of on the other end. And they took this whole Swiss or whatever look with the turrets and the stuff to heart up here and it's everywhere. Well, up here at Disneyland Drive, and real beautiful morning. That's right across from the convention center here. Up here for a packaging convention that I put off until the last day somehow. And I'm now here to get it done. Tippy's, that's been there for years. Restaurant, ice cream parlor, we go. Seems to take longer when um, you're filming. Paradise Pier Hotel. Lots of Disney themed hotels and such. Well, that makes sense, right? 
And we've got four theme parks here. Whip out your hundred bucks a day and come have fun. Spend four or five hundred a day for tickets and you can bring the whole family. Alpine Inn, that has been there forever. And has as has the Jolly Roger. All right, the overnight parking I can understand, but no backing my bins into my stall. I mean, come on. That just makes it... Got a fly just... Well, a little gnat just flew in my mouth. Come on, you can't back in? That's ridiculous. And you better have a low car because... Man, that stuff's... All right, there, I can... Without even tiptoeing, palm it. And I'm going to get out of here and show a little bit of the convention center real quick. Real pretty out here. Real nice. There's meeting halls and ballroom. This place goes on forever. Right across from Disney. Or one of the Disney parks. I don't know which one. Well, that's kind of a once or twice around here. And look at the convention center. I want to walk out front here. Get a better view. Mission Grapes. Wow! By 1864, they were producing 300,000 gallons of wine from its 400,000 vines. Wow! That's interesting. Never knew that. Lived in this area my whole life, pretty much, back and forth. Now, Napa Valley and all, we all know how that is. But this Anaheim Valley is beautiful, too. I guess I'd think it's worth a little bit more as Disney and the Sheridan than it is wine-producing country. But, who knows? Cool pavers and stuff up here. I like how they do everything. Kind of rural... Real European, but well, just wanted to take you around the convention center, get you around the front here to kind of show it all. My name's Nathan. It's OneOwnerCarGuy.com. You can get on there and check out a lot of my inventory. Lots of really clean, unique, unusual one and two owner classic euro muscle cars uh, collectible investments stuff that going up in value not down in value that's all there is to say about it that's the kind of stuff you'll see on my site call me up if something interests you nathan 406-544-6919 that is the convention center dome thing here Let's go around really at the front and all that for you there you go well that's about it I'll clip a few of these together kind of show you the area and such and thanks for watching make sure to check out some of my other videos about 600 of them on here we'll see you